When merging, there may be scenarios where features may conflict after a merge, or the merge produces unintended results. This video explores how to fix conflicted features after a merge or how to undo a merge. When using merge changes from both, all the changes in one branch merge to another branch, including new features and tabs created, edits done to the features and tabs, and deletions to features and tabs. This document contains several workspaces that have different design iterations of the assembly. I want to merge the workspace from this branch into the main workspace. Main is the target workspace, so it should be the active workspace. In the versions and history graph, right-click on the workspace we want to merge from, or the source, and click Merge to Current Workspace. The Merge dialog displays allowing us to choose what should be merged from each changed tab. Let's choose to merge changes from both. Now the source workspace is merged with the target workspace. After the merge, you can see that the chamfer feature appears in red at the end of the feature list of the Part Studio. This is because the edge that was chamfered did not exist in the target workspace. It contained a fillet before the merge was created. Here is an example of a merge conflict. In this case, you can decide which feature you want to keep in the design, the fillet or the chamfer. Let's replace the fillet with the chamfer. Simply delete the fillet, and the chamfer can now build in the part studio. One thing to remember when merging, deleting entities in a document like tabs, features, and instances is also a change captured within the document's history. For example, if you delete a tab in the source workspace, the merge dialog warns that the tab has been deleted and it does not have an option to merge the changes from both. Instead, only keep or replace are available options. In this case, choosing keep leaves the tab intact as is in the target workspace, and choosing replace removes the tab in the target workspace as it does not exist in the source workspace. What if a merge creates unintentional results and causes a list of features to error or removes several tabs. You may want to undo the merge to restore the workspace to before these changes happened. Open the version and history graph and go to the change before the merge. Right click and choose restore to main. Now the document is restored to the moment before the merge happened and all deleted tabs or feature list errors have been restored. Remember that every change, edit, or deletion is captured within an OnShape document, including merges. Merging is a powerful tool within OnShape. It allows you to combine multiple design iterations, features, and tabs into a single workspace without having to create a new document with the desired changes. If any conflicts arise or unintentional changes occur, it is easy to restore the workspace to the previous state. 